Have you ever felt overwhelmed by a large number of different and contradictory versions of the same story? Then maybe you have been a victim of a disinformation tactic called bubble. Keep watching to learn more about this kind of manipulation and why it's dangerous. The goal of disinformation is not always to convince us of a manipulated or false version of a story. Sometimes what the people behind disinformation want is to sow confusion and doubt. This behavior is often seen during crisis situations and disasters, but also during elections. Those trying to deceive us flood social media with different explanations and accusations. They often use artificial bots or trolls to spam as many channels as possible with a large amount of messages. They do this to control online conversations and drown out voices and views that are inconvenient to them. The different stories often contradict each other, even from the same source. This is a sign that the real goal is not to convince us of one particular story, but to confuse us. When the Malaysian Airlines flight was shot down over eastern Ukraine in July 2014, it was quickly followed by numerous different claims about what happened. Experts have counted almost 300 cases of disinformation about the disaster. It was blamed on different countries and organizations, and various theories about what happened were shared widely. The goal seemed to be to spread confusion and prevent people from searching from the facts. What's the danger? With so many different explanations, we may find it easier to tune out and do nothing. Our expert explains why it's dangerous. In the longer term, this tactic can have a destructive effect on society if people start questioning the existence of objective facts or if they stop believing that it is possible to establish a fact-based reality. If everything is perceived as an equally valid version of reality, trust in media and in democratic institutions may suffer. It's of course important and healthy to see things from different perspectives and have a dose of critical skepticism. But if people start questioning things that are backed by facts, the people behind the manipulation have reached their goal of spreading confusion, apathy and distrust. What can you do? Be careful when it comes to major crisis situations and disasters. If you see many different or contradictory versions of the same story, somebody may be trying to manipulate you. Not to convince you, but to confuse you. Check high quality and fact-checked sources. Help them spread their message. Prioritize quality over speed. Remember that it takes time to do research and check the facts. Being first with the story isn't always a sign of quality. Resist falling into the trap of apathy and inaction. Don't stop believing that there are real facts out there. To recap, watch out when you come across contradictory versions of the same story. Look for reliable and fact-checked sources. Prefer quality over speed. Check out our website for more information about the European Parliament and the 2024 European elections.